Meghan's special Father's Day gift revealed it's really beautiful and meaningful. The Duchess of Sussex is now a mother of two. The Duchess of Sussex is sending out a copy of her new book, The Bench, to dress ahead of Father's Day on Sunday. Author Matt Haig revealed Meghan's thoughtful gift in a post on Twitter, showing off a beautifully handwritten note in her signature calligraphy style. Alongside a photo of the book's cover, one note read, with compliments of the office of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. A more personal message read, Dear Matt, Happy Father's Day. With love and respect from our family to yours. As ever, Megan. Earlier this week it was announced that her illustrated children's novel has hit number one on the New York Times bestsellers list. In the children's picture books category an amazing feat for Megan's debut book. Which was released this month. The listing is reported to appear in the 27th of June edition of the Times. The book tells the story of the special relationship between father and son, as seen through a mother's eyes. And Meghan has previously revealed that her husband, Prince Harry, and firstborn, Archie, were the inspiration behind it. She said, The bench started as a poem I wrote for my husband on Father's Day, the month after Archie was born. That poem became his story. In a statement, the former actress added, in many ways, pursuing a more compassionate and equitable world begins with these core values. Equally, to depict another side of masculinity, one grounded in connection, emotion, and softness is to model a world that so many would like to see for their sons and daughters alike. Thank you for supporting me in this special project. The first illustration in the book by best-selling artist, Christian Robinson, appears to be one of Harry and baby Archie walking hand in hand together. Megan said of the illustrator, Christian layered in beautiful and ethereal watercolor illustrations that capture the warmth, joy, and comfort of the relationship between fathers and sons from all walks of life, this representation was particularly important to me. And Christian and I worked closely to depict this special bond through an inclusive lens. Historian Robert Lacey, who consults on the Crown, claims the brothers split. After William confronted Harry about allegations of bullying made against Meghan Markle by Palace staff. Sensational new claims about the fracturing of the close relationship between between Prince William and Prince Harry have emerged in a new book by historian Robert Lacey. Lacey has updated Battle of Brothers, the inside story of a family and tumult with added chapters and new material. And in new excerpts in the Times newspaper in the UK published on Saturday. The veteran writer outlines more details of their split. William and Harry were originally said to have fallen out over William's doubts about the speed at which his brother was moving with his girlfriend Meghan. Lacey writes that although relations between the princes had eased by the time of Harry and Meghan's May 2018 wedding, they worsened again in October 2018 when William learned that a senior palace aide was making allegations of bullying by Meghan to staffers. When William heard those claims and confronted his brother, they had a fierce and bitter argument. Lacey writes leading William to start moves to remove Harry and Meghan from the joint office, or household, they shared. William threw Harry out, a friend tells Lacey. When the bullying claims first emerged, in the Times in the UK in March, the Duchess of Sussex's office strongly refuted the allegations. The palace set up an independent inquiry into the claims and how they were handled. Lacey's book describes an angry confrontation between the princes first over the phone. And then in person when William asked Harry about the bullying claims. When Harry flared up in furious defense of his wife, the elder brother persisted, reads an excerpt. Harry shut off his phone angrily, so William went to speak to him personally. The prince was horrified by what he had just been told about Meghan's alleged behavior. And he wanted to hear what Harry had to say. The showdown between the brothers was fierce and bitter. Representatives for Kensington Palace, where William has his office, did not comment on the claims made in the book. Lacey also claims that Kate Middleton had been wary of Meghan from the start, and says that William told a friend he thought she had an agenda, and that the allegations he was now hearing in fall of 2018 appear to support his initial reservations about Meghan. Lacey quotes a Kensington Palace staffer as saying that people felt run over by Meghan and didn't know how to handle her. The new excerpts come as the brothers prepare to reunite to unveil a statue commemorating the life of their late mother, Princess Diana, on the 1st of July, which would have been her 60th birthday. In the first edition of the book, 
Lacey explored the rift, rooting the schism in their parents' turbulent marriage. Both brothers have been damaged by their upbringings, both have reacted by finding different solutions. Says the author, who is also the historical consultant for Netflix's The Crown. There is so much pain and trauma in this story, going right back to the beginning. He said that mounting tensions accompanied Harry and Meghan Markle's whirlwind relationship. The fundamental conflict was between the two males who had known each other all their lives. And had never hesitated to tell each other exactly what they thought and felt, Lacey wrote. William worried that his brother was moving too fast in his courtship. And he did not shrink from saying as much when Harry started talking about getting hitched to Meghan quite soon. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, would you please help us like, share and subscribe our channel. Wish you happy to see our videos, thank you very much.